ankle dorsiflexion pales and rails. So for ankle dorsiflexion, uh, ankle dorsiflexion is bent knee ankle stretching. Uh, the easiest way to go for me is to put my foot up on a squat rack or a wall and then uh, bend the knee in. I like to make sure that my ankle is close enough to the wall or rack so that it's not a massive toe stretch, that it's really directed into my ankle. And then I'm gonna bend my ankle in as far as I can. If this is uncomfortable for you, if you have really tight ankles, it might be easier to put a bumper plate on the ground and then just kind of bend forward. So I would elevate my toe up onto the bumper plate and then push forward this way. Play with both of those. If you don't feel a stretch in this position, that might be the cause. It also might be that your ankle bones and ligaments are so tight that they're not moving enough for you to get a stretch to those posterior tissues. That just is a hard block that will take a long time to work through, but don't, don't feel bad if you don't feel a stretch. Okay, so we're in this position here. For pails, so if you're gonna do this for uh, developing mobility, you'll hold the passive stretch for a minute to three minutes, um, and then you will do pail. So a pails contraction here is pushing the foot into away from. So we are resisting the stretch, contracting the lengthened tissues. So I'm going to start to ramp up tension, pushing my foot into the post, and it's a high intensity effort. So you're gonna spread that contraction through your whole body. You're gonna push as hard as you can for 10 seconds. You're gonna back off. And then rails is the opposite. You're gonna to try to pull your knee closer to the post and pull your foot closer to your shin. So all of those uh, regressive tissues on the closing angle side of the joint are squeezing. Um, and then you're gonna relax, try to get more range, pushing farther in, and we're gonna hold that for another one to three minutes. That's for mobility development. If this is an exercise superset and it just says ankle dorsiflexion pales, you're gonna get into the position, get comfortable for about 10 seconds, and you're gonna ramp up that isometric contraction, pushing away, and then relax.